Well, the guy behind me is Aaron Cook from Westminster Christian Academy. He now plays for Gonzaga. He's trying to become the first male basketball player from our town to win a national championship since Terry Donnelly. I caught up with Terry today. There'll be some important decisions made tonight. The date was March 26th, 1979 in Salt Lake City. It's the most watched college game of all time. Bird versus Magic. State wearing number 11 at guard, six foot two inch junior from St. Louis, Missouri, Terry Donnelly. And yet, a skinny kid from Parkway North played a starring role. State leads by one, Kelser. Donnelly shoots rarely right down the bottom of the well. Larry Bird came up to honor Magic Johnson at a Michigan State event. He goes, I want to tell you something. Don't ever let Irvin tell you that he won that game. If you hadn't hit those five shots, we probably would have beat you. Counting free throws and field goals, Donnelly took 11 total shots that night. He made 10 of them. His coach, Judd Heathcote, gave him a warning. Terry, look, your man is gonna double on Urban to keep him from penetrating. You're gonna have to hit the open jumpers, and, and lo and behold, that's what happened in the second half. Imagine, in the biggest game of your life, with the world watching, you are nearly perfect. That's what Terry Donnelly was. You know, if I miss those five shots and we lose that game, you know, Irvin Johnson's life probably doesn't change. Terry Donnelly's life changed, and uh, very proud of it. He got a little emotional there, and I would too. What a moment for this young man from Parkway North High School. What a player. Yeah.